Well, hello everyone. My name is Claudia Silva. I would like to welcome to the 18 Student Council Symposium, a forum for students and young researchers in the field of computational biology and bioinformatics. As organizing committee, we know that the last two years have been different due to worldwide pandemic caused by SARS-CoV-2, where many academics and personal challenges have presented themselves and have shaken important aspects aspect of scientific development of <clears throat> for this reason i would like to begin in this activity by thanking everyone for your attendance <clears throat> well uh, the student council is an international student group made of members of around the world who share a passion for bioinformatics and computational biology. The Student Council is organized into teams and committees, each with its own tasks and responsibilities. <clears throat> Designed to provide the student with support and resources. The Student Council is part of the International Society of Computational Biology, and such they work closely with the International Society leadership to achieve their goals. Its mission is to promote the development of the next, next generation of computational biology, <coughs> computational biology, through the development of scientific events networking opportunities, soft skill training, educational resource, and career advice while attempting to improve policy process related to science and education. <clears throat> uh, the IECD Student Council and its RSG are supported by various committees and in their teams. The principal committee is the executive uh, team, and I would like to thank who, the executive team who supported and guided us during the organizations. And the executive, the executive team are composed by uh, Dr. Melik Donertas as a chair, Gabriel Olguin as a vice chair, Ana Castillo as secretary. Dr. Jesse Cuesta Astros as treasurer, Pradeep Erante as our research student group committee chair, Windows Aracu as a diversity and inclusion chair, and Gonzalo Parra as International Society for Computational Biology Board of Director Representative. The role of the executive team is the sustainable development of the student council and its regional student groups and the coordination for all activities. For this purpose, several committees are established and our executive team is responsible for managing these committees. The, the RSG committee led by Pradeep Eranti serves as channel for communication between the student council and research student groups. The web committee led by Spencer Krieger and Whit Cooper have the main task of web committee to maintain and develop the web infrastructure of the student council, including a student council portal and a student council symposium website. The membership, oh, sorry, the, the education and internship committee led by Ana Castillo is aimed to help in student develop research and academic skill in computational biology and alleviating the divide across countries. To this end, the committee carried out different programs and activities. The membership committee, as a membership and outreach committee led by Nasifa Fatima, is the responsible for keeping the member of the ISCB and a student council up to date on our work. Beyond that, the committee plans and implements all activities related to membership recruitment and the promotion of the student council outside the 
International Society, student, uh, International Society for Computational Biology. And finally, the uh, Finance Committee led by Yasip Cuesta Tros, who is responsible for the finances of the Student Council. He, he is responsible for creating and managing the yearly budget. He oversees expenses and uh, generate funds to support the Student Council general activities, as well as specific events. For example, through, uh, through the recruitment for a sponsor, application for grant, and guide the research student group in the fundraising activities. The Student Council organizing different events such as uh, a student council symposium, European student council symposium, Latin American student council symposium, and African student council symposium, sorry, uh, African and American, with the aim to take, take up the challenges and increase the student council symposium presence. I would like to thank the core organization team composed by Yasim Kaya from RSG Turkey and Claudia Silva from RSG Chile as a chair, Ayuch Gruer from India and Maria Martinez from RSG Argentina as program chairs, Sumitra Lili from RSG India as program committee chair, Eda Sami Loglu from RSG Turkey as design committee chair, Engine Tadil from RSG Turkey as outreach committee chair, uh, Semil Kansalan from RSG Turkey as a web committee chair, Edah Kandir from RSG Turkey as outreach committee chair and Arsalan from RSG Pakistan and as a finance committee chair. To their hard work and dedication during the organization of this event. I really appreciate your perseverance, patience and dedication to making this event happen. I am sure that without your participation, this event could not take place with the quality that it's will. Guys, was a pleasure to meet and work with you. Before the start with the lecture, I would like to mention that today we will have our first keynote speaker, the Dr. Marinka Sidnik with her talk title Infusing a Structure and Knowledge into Biomedical IA or amazing open science and reproducible data in computational biology round table, led by Dr. Tommy Tang and Jo Heun. And today we have five oral presentation. The first is titled Com Computing Optimal Factories in Metabolic Networks with Negative Regulation, presented by Spencer Krieger. The second is titled Integ Integrating Gene Expression Profiles with Not Coding Somatic Mutation Analysis to Identify Key regulation Regulators of Metastasis in Triple Negative Breast Cancer, present by Pedro Salaberry. The third oral presentation is titled La Sonolida A, it synthesized by a uh, trans AT PKS. PKS pathway present in an uncultured Berroco microbiota present by Sidar Hupal. The fourth oral presentation is titled Mo Molecular Characterization of Rinella Miradariveroi and Rinella Granulosa Population present by Julian Sebastián Ramírez Moreno. And the last oral presentation of the day. It's a pre-record presentation titled Exploring the Chemical Space of Antiparasitic Pep Peptides and Discovery a New Promising Leads Through Another Approach Based on Network Science and Similarity Searching, created by Sebastián Ayala Ruano. And today uh, we have six flash talk posters. The first 
splash talk poster is titled Genomic Analysis of FMR1 Cluster, Possible Implication in Fragile X Associated Disease, present by Marina Luz Ingravidi. The second is titled Mitochondrial Single Nucleotide Polymorphins, associated with patients with type 2 diabetes, present by Enrique Garcia Gaona. The third uh, flash talk poster is titled Epitope Evaluator, an interactive web application to study predicted T cells epitopes, present by Luis Soto. The next flash talk is post, uh, poster is titled CTCF Binding Prediction Using Genomic and Epigenomic Features, present by Camilo Villaman. The next is titled In Silico Identification of New, Gene, of New Genes and Pathway Involved in the Progression of Malignant Prevalent Mesothelioma, a Meta Analysis of Genome Wide Expression Studies, present by Alejandro Mejia Garcia. And the last flash talk poster of the day is titled UV Sensor Proteins in Anurans, present by Hugo Oliveira. Today, we have the poster session and during the poster session we have different breakout rooms to visit the different posters uh, you can ask using the chat box or rising hub also i i invite you to use the hashtag of our symposium on your social networks uh, now i want to invite to uh, a huge grover who will moderate the oral presentation sessions. Thank you very much. <laughs>